Uh, Charlie Gallo from the Lynn School Committee here at the uh, Breed Middle School, and I think turnout's great today. We've had already in one precinct, which is uh, Precinct 7-1, over 2,200 votes. Uh, many new voters and, and many folks who are back after not voting for a long time. So I hope to see a great turnout, and I think that is what we're seeing today. I think it's great. Um, this is democracy in action. Um, every year we drive to a school or a fire station and we overthrow the government without a tank in the street. And regardless of who wins, right or left, um, the system's working. So it's great to be here. Well, I hope to see my uh, candidates win. <laughs> but uh, I think they're there for the right reasons. So, uh, you know, for people, middle class people, and uh, for health care. And... Hopefully they fix our economy and, shit and give us uh, better jobs, more, or more job opportunities. The uh, administration that's already intact remains intact. It's critical for everybody's well-being. Well, um, I, I hope to make sure that the country keeps moving forward in the right direction. And um, I, I'd love to see that, um, you know, Obama gets another four years in office. I think he deserves it and he earned it. The re-election of the president and uh, actually, hopefully, a change in Congress. Well, aside from seeing Scott Brown win, uh, I'm really hoping that after all of the um, debate and uh, discourse oh, yeah. that we yeah. come together and start doing the right thing for this country. Results. I think that the ballot questions are, are pretty interesting this year, touch on a, a few hot button issues. One is the uh, medical marijuana issue, another is the right to die uh, with dignity issue. And another is the right to repair issue. I'm certainly in favor of the right to repair issue. Um, I'll, I'll leave my opinions alone on the, the others, but to say that they're interesting and a lot of people are excited about those ballot questions. I thought they were interesting. I'd like to see the, the uh, limits on campaign spending, and I don't think corporations are business, are people. I feel the car one would be good if we had um, the chance to bring our cars to any uh, garage. Uh, the suicide one, uh, if they work on it maybe a little better, the, in the future it could be checked again. Um, the marijuana one, I, I don't see why not. I mean, it's not going to harm me in any way, so um, hopefully it makes their time here better. And uh, the corporation one, uh, I didn't even know about, so I just had to kind of go with uh, my gut on that one. But uh, hopefully it all works out. I hope to see that the medical marijuana law is passed and vote yes on question three. They all revolve around more freedom, personal freedom to citizens. I, I think it's great. They were tough. I think I got at least two out of four correct though. And I'm hoping a 50% is passing in this case. But uh, I'm really not sure. Got my fingers crossed because I've been studying real hard. There should be yes on all of them. I'm, I support them all actually, all three of them. I'm in favor of uh, the right to repair, I'm in favor of medical marijuana if it's used for medicine, and uh, I think people have the right to die with dignity. I think the ballot questions are something that's been a long time coming. It certainly will uh, benefit, I think, everybody here in Massachusetts, definitely one and three.